Whoa, watch it, doll. What's the big hurry? Sorry, Elko. Tilly, I'm late. I'm really late. Oh. My apologies, ma'am. Ah, oh, you clumsy ox. Watch your step. Whoa. Late again, Tal! I haven't the time to wait around for you. You're supposed to be a soldier. Now listen up, for I'm about to change your lives forever. I'm gonna make men of you if it's the last thing I do. Now, you might be asking yourself, why did you join the army? Well, I'll tell you. So then, Yemi, what's on the agenda today? Elko switches on his tower this afternoon, but you promised we could visit my mother today? Ooh, lucky me. I get to spend all day in a village full of old men. You must have been very bored growing up. I had a lovely time. Only boring people get bored. Really? Well, I was hoping for something a little more exciting, that's all. Perhaps a troop inspection. <laughs> Wake up, soldier! Haven't you heard a single word I've said? Today is another beautiful day to learn the art of killing. The elite guard treats an enemy's death as an art form. You will learn to cut closer and thrust without mercy. What now? General Arlo, may I have a quick word? This had better be good. I don't need to remind you these soldiers are on active duty. It's just a little VIP visit. Perhaps you could rustle up a display, please? This isn't the circus, it's the army! It is by Her Majesty's request, General Arlo. Is it? Then I guess I'll have to make another exception. Who is she? Her name is Buki. It's her tribe that hold the crystal I was telling you about. Ah, Honorable Buki, we are in luck as it happens. The General here was just putting the elite guard through their paces. General? Yes, Miss, uh, Buki. Uh, now, if you'll step this way, you can watch as we run over the basics of swordsmanship. Tal, you may begin. the art of swordsmanship. Remember, your sword is your best friend. As you can see, Miss Buki, if you love your sword, you can keep the whole world at arm's length. You fight well, but a Shadani warrior does not hide behind a sword. 
I like to see the fear in their eyes and smell the sweat on their brow. There is no substitute for a good sword in your hands. Slow and cumbersome, like all men. <laughs> good riddance. Now listen up, men! Intelligence suggests the Aquarians will darken our skies again soon. Now, we don't understand their motives, but it's down to us to try and stop them from entering Illumina. Aquarians employ guerrilla tactics and show no respect for the rules of engagement. They will use every dirty trick they can, and that includes the use of light spawn creatures. These monsters take many forms, so you'd better be prepared for anything. The enemy attacks in small berserker groups, and the Queen has decreed we are to take no prisoners. Now, there's a lot of country to cover out there, so make sure you all have your own map to navigate with. yourself a map of the wilderness before you go on duty. And go to Kamo's shop in the northeast corner of the marketplace and pick one up. Maps are free to soldiers by order of the Queen. Sure, it's in the northeast corner of the courtyard. Follow me and I'll show you. soldiers by order of the Queen. Welcome to Camos. No kids, no smoking, no drinking, no touching, and no credit! Now, how may I help you? It's cheapskates like you that make me work longer hours. Tal, the alarm bells are ringing. There are reports of skirmishes on the road to New Brightwater. Arlo wants you to lead a patrol across country in case Princess Ailish gets caught up in the action.
time has come to put your training to good use. I want every piece of Aquarian scum removed from the area before sundown. Sir, yes, sir. March to New Brightwater and make sure the road is secure. Tao, take charge of the two rookies and we'll rendezvous in New Brightwater. Sir. Stain the floor with your insides!
Arlo wants the area cleared at any cost, but he hasn't seen that monster yet.
to see you, man. It's been there's no sign of the princess, princess yet. Yeah, I feel the locals said she'd already passed through just before the sun came out. I guess I she made it to Brighton or okay. okay. The Chlorians have really come out in numbers this time. We did all we could, but we're too late for this guy. They brought three or four different types of troops this time. They also seem to have a giant fighting alongside them, if the reports are to be believed. That house was used as a hideout by pirates. We thought there might be treasure inside, but we can't find anything in there. But feel free to look for yourself. It's a case of finders keepers out here in the wilds.
Tetsu. I speak with the voice of your ancestors. The road ahead is dark and filled with danger, but fear not, son of Sudeki. In your darkest hours you may call on me. My humble servant, Cariston the Wolf, will protect you. Get up! What happened to the rest of your men, Tal? I... I, uh... I expected more from you. Those soldiers were your responsibility. It's time you learn that sometimes there are more important people around than you, Tal! Princess Ailish is in New Brightwater. See that she gets back to the castle safely. Now that the Eclorians have been cleared from the area, I hope that you can be trusted to guard a girl. Get out of my sight! Have you come to try it? Lay your skin on me. I can't get enough. What a pleasure it is to serve you. I like the furry side of the business, but some traders like scales. Keep your eye out for Hambos. He likes the uncompromising feel of scales and will pay a good price.
Hey, New Brightwater has a royal guest today. That's right. Princess Ailish of Illumina passed right by here but a few minutes ago. She was arguing with her maid about something or other, so I didn't say hello. Sure. According to village gossip, she will be at Denzi's house. He can't miss it. Straight down the hill, in the center of town, there's a big blue house. Hello. Is Princess Ailish here? I'm to escort her home. The princess? Oh, good luck. She's in such a contrary mood. She stormed off to the lighthouse almost as soon as we arrived. Son, tell, right? Call me Ailish. Yes, Your Highness. Thank goodness you're safe. I've been sent to escort you home. There was some trouble with the Eclorians near here and... Let's go then. I never wanted to come to this dreary little town in the first place. Besides, I promised Elko I'd see his crystal tower light up. You know Elko. Chief Science Officer Elko? Yes, Your Highness. Elko really helped me settle in when I first moved to Illumina. I thought I told you to call me Ailish. Now, let's leave before we become all... provincial. Yes, pr I mean, Ailish.
Ailish, I'm not sure that when General Arlo asked me to escort you home that he meant only you. What about you? What about her? She'll be fine. I thought you said that your patrol had cleared the area anyway. For now, yes. But experience tells me the Chlorians will be back. I'm sure they will be. But I'm not overly concerned. I can look after myself. Hey, you better leave the fighting to me. I've heard too many soldiers say that right before they... Oh, stop it, Tao. You sound just like your father. I'm not some ignorant little grunt you've been put in charge of. I might be a weak and feeble woman, but I am also one of the finest magicians in the realm. Really? Okay then, miss. Why don't you show me just what makes you so special that you believe you're above the help of the elite guard? Don't be shy.
one's just for you. I'm boss, Aaron Skin Trainer to the Hinterlands. What sort of hide can you offer me? such a sucker for a scaly skin. Not really. If you ever trade in gems, I'd advise you to seek out Mandrake. He has more money than sense.